telling you, mate. Sounds like some out of murder she wrote. Gravel from the road in the back of his head. No shit. That's unbelievable. Well, what's that? Frank, mate. Wasn't an accident after all. Looks like I'd done him over and put him back in the car. Please been around my gaff and all asking questions. And some of the other lads. Yeah, we only had an hour of it, didn't we, Jace? <sighs> Makes you feel guilty by association, doesn't it? I know what you mean, sir. Don't over-dramatise, hmm? They're looking for witnesses, that's all. But I thought they proved it were drunk driving. Yeah, I suppose he could have stopped for a wee, fallen over or something, then got back in the car and thought it was OK. Who knows? There's someone who can't obviously be with us here today. And Carl and myself, on behalf of everyone, I think, would like to give a special mention to Frank Lesler. Get well soon, Frank. Hello, my love. You miss me? Well, not to worry now. I'm on a double. So you don't have to put up with any of those nasty part-timers till tomorrow. I'm going to be with you all through the night. So we'll have plenty of time for gossip. Hmm? Anything you want. You just ask your special nurse, Dunkley. Hmm? How's that? Perfect. Tarpin enough. I don't know why you're bothering, though. Oh, can't have Frank missing his boy's big game, can we? Chemistry going now, and I think the prospects are very good for the season. Oh, I'll get that for you, Frank, my love. Got to have our dignity, hmm? Handsome man like you.